With every breath I feel alive I got a lot of Okay, ninja. Assalamu alaikum. Welcome back. Check it out. Check it out. Playing uh, Wild Rift uh, with the gamepad, guys. Using the 5DG Apex 2, the pro gaming. This is the best gamepad in the world for three platforms, iOS, PC, and Windows. I'm telling you, you can't find a more versatile, more unique, better uh, specs, hardware, software itself all together. This is it, ninjas. This is the beast of the beast, the gamepad uh, of the year, I would call it like that. You can play uh, through the Fly DG app, uh, example, these kind of games, and that is nuts. Check it out. If I want to upgrade that one, I just simply go, like, check this out. <laughs> Here the phone is on the top uh, on the bottom left corner you can see it by itself beautiful 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 anyway you'll have the buying links in the description i'm using the ROG 5 and now if you want attack i'm just using the x button wait a minute a button yeah a button here we go oh my god that is so impressive if i want to use a special power i just use of course l1 or l2 rt lt i mean rt lt wow man wow that is beautiful, that is seriously beautiful. I'm gonna just bring my hand here so you can guys see that I'm playing. Yeah, I think I'm gonna just stay here. Check it out. <laughs> Legendary, whoa. Awesome, awesome. Oh, we're gonna run a little bit back, we're gonna run a little bit back. Come on, come on. Okay, let's upgrade all the weapons, we've done it. Oh, I'm gonna run a little bit. So you can see myself, I can also move around the map way faster and more fluent than with the touch. <laughs> because this is like mu much more uh, like much more uh, convenient with the gamepad itself. Uh, and you can see myself, this is a pro gaming uh, gamepad, guys. It has so many different buttons that, I mean, every single action, I think, over the screen you can almost add. Uh, almost, I'm saying almost, because we still have a lot of options over here. We just have here six actions, guys. One, two, three, four, five, six. And plus the map, seven. In just on left corner, we have seven uh, uh, actions here. Obviously, you will have to have a gamepad with, what, how many buttons? You will have to have with 30 buttons, man. <laughs> Whoa, run, 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 run. Beautiful, man. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. I don't know, did I assemble, did I add this button over here? I'm not sure. Start? Oh, I did, I did. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. That is so cool. Let me enjoy. Let me enjoy this. Oh, wait a minute. That is so beautiful, man. That is honestly so beautiful. Apex, FlyDG Apex 2, ROG 5. You'll have the buying links in the description. Oh my god, that is, that is, I don't know why I didn't do something like this before, this is so awesome man, to have this kind of a gamepad uh, with a smartphone that supports NHL video output, so every single, almost every single game, I think it supports uh, all, all Android games, guys. Remember that uh, these games don't uh, support gamepads on default, you have to have, uh, you have to have a special mapping applications uh, to map, and this can't work with every single uh, gamepad. Plus, uh, the free applications which we have on the Play Store, they are not that stable, guys. Uh, plus, they also remove the data. Uh, plus, they also crash. So far, the Fly DG app, I don't have these problems whatsoever. Okay, I'm gonna go back here. He's gonna run after me. Now, oh, this is how I access. Oh, this is how I access. Okay. Okay. Beautiful. By the way, I'm playing on maximum graphics. And by the way, I stretched also the screen a little bit. Maybe the, the screen looks a little bit weird. I'm gonna just go right now to uh, menu, frequent settings. We're gonna go to uh, picture format, original. And this is the original, guys. Like you see myself, this is the original format right now. Okay, this is the original format. We're gonna now assemble all of these things. That is beautiful now. Stupid sentence. I don't know why they even add that sentence. Stupid. Okay. Let's go.
Oh my god, Dr. Mundo of <laughs> the bot. Okay. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Attack him, attack him, attack him, attack him. Oh, that was a nice kill. That was a nice kill there, guys. Come on, come on. Where, where are my minions in the lane? Where are they? Okay, I'm seeing them, I'm seeing them. Hide. Awesome, man. Awesome. Oh, 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 he's coming, he's coming. Oh, I'm having a monster here. Awesome. Oh, he attacked me now. Run, 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 run. Oh, it's so fast, man. What, what a great gaming experience here with this Flight DG. Gamepad, I couldn't believe it, man. I know it's pricey, guys, but it's worth every cent. That I'm telling you, this is just beautiful. This is just so, so, seriously beautiful. Uh, what kind of gaming experience you have right now with this kind of a gamepad? Uh, with the Fly DG gaming uh, mapping app. Okay, well, now we are in the middle lane. We're in the middle lane now. Okay. <laughs> nice kill. Okay, we're following. Ah, okay, 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 okay. Kill, kill, but nice, nice kill, nice kill there. Nice kill over there. Awesome. Oh, I mean, I think this is it. You get the point, in Jazz. Uh, of course, now we're gonna show you the tutorial how you're gonna use this application, how you're gonna play uh, this game, and I'll be adding the same tutorial with my uh, other videos, which obviously the Android games which do not have uh, default gamepad support, and you will have to get buy, basically buy yourself uh, a really great gamepad with a, a great app support. I'm telling you there is example octopus but i'm hearing so many different problems with the octopus uh, it crashes uh, and not so many games are working there example or you have to buy example the pro version premium version of the octopus etc uh, etc et plus with the octopus you lose the data you need to it just uh, it's it's really bad experience so far with the fly dg i love it man fly dg apex 2 gamepad check this monster man check. by the way yes it does have also uh the clipper, the clipper to attach the, uh, of course, the smartphone. But obviously, the smartphone is not here right now. The smartphone is just next to the TV. Let's go. Okay, so now we'll be showing you how we are playing these games with this gamepad, guys. Uh, you need to install yourself an application which is called Fly Digi. Uh, we're gonna get exit right now everything quickly here. We're gonna go here to uh, Play Store. Okay, and this is the Fly DG app, guys. Fly DG Game Center app. This, just basically download yourself this app, open it, and from here, guys, you can access uh, you can access uh, different games. I mean, you can add every single game which you have. Uh, I repeat again, some games they do have on default gamepad support. Not so many games have a gamepad support. I mean, most of the games don't have a gamepad support. So that's why you need to have this kind of gamepad and the application itself. From here, obviously, you're gonna access and you're gonna pair it through this application with, uh, via Bluetooth uh, application. And remember always to uh, upgrade your gamepad, your basically your gamepad software. It's already updated the latest for the Fly, Fly DG Apex 2, okay? So now, uh, if you want to add, you add the games from here. Simple, guys. Like see myself, I don't add the Arc. I'm not gonna add Assault 9. These games have a gamepad default support, okay? So now we're gonna go to the Fly DG, uh, to the, uh, of course, uh, Wild Drift. And from here, I'm gonna just move here. You can see myself, I'm playing it right now with the gamepad. Which is insane, a mobile game ninjas. I will also try to do this uh, test with the Mobile Legends, but with the Wild Drift, Wild Drift, it's working just fine. So, uh, how are you gonna assemble all of this, and where in the heck the buttons? How you do this? So, on the top corner, or it's usually here on the right side, top right side, you have this Fly DG icon, guys. Tap this Fly DG icon, and from here you're gonna access 
uh, basically uh, the customization button so you go to edit you can add uh, for every single game a different obviously profile and I would suggest you to do that if you are playing these games uh, frequently okay let me just exit sorry for that I'm gonna just exit here cancel Okay, they will kick me out, bloody them. So you're gonna go to edit and from here you can see by yourself, you assemble uh, the actions of the gamepad to each action you want. So you can see by yourself that most of the things I could add, but obviously some of the things are still missing. The map, these three options, option, mute, and microphone, you could do that. And also here some alert uh, actions, you can add uh, these functions all together. Beautiful, isn't it? Seriously, it's beautiful. So it's simple, guys. So you just drag. Example, the arrows I use for the upgrades. The arrows I use for the upgrades. There you go. You can see by yourself. So I use them, just uh, the arrows I use for the upgrades. After you finish that, you just simply tap here, save. And that's it. That's it. Simple like that. After that, you just use the save. Remember to uh, obviously assemble uh, for each action one single button, but for some actions you can even uh, assemble the same button for two actions. Why? Because you can, example, uh, do this action and, example, open the map in the same time. Th that's not going to be any problem. That's gonna, not going to be any problem, example, okay? So yeah, that's it. That's a very short tutorial. I repeat again, if you want to hide these options or show them, if you want to see here, you have an option here to show the buttons. And you can see by yourself, the buttons are shown right now. For which action are they are they here yeah beautiful so now we're gonna again disable them show them back you can go here to back to the screen and i'm gonna go again which is really good the game uh, the fly dg app doesn't close the game which is really good that's that's really good and always have in mind that uh, uh, have it always active in the background this is very important so it doesn't close your game that is very very important from here recommendation we have some applications blah 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 that is fine extensions you can see by stuff here these are the extensions the buttons on the back r1 r3 l3 select and menu all together can also assemble all these buttons to the action which is again insane guys insane 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 Anyway, so that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Uh, this was the tutorial for the Apex. Uh, very simple tutorial for these games which you see on my YouTube channel. These videos which I'm testing. Games, Android games that don't have uh, uh, gamepad support on default. You will have to yourself, buy yourself uh, Apex 2 uh, and FlyDG app if you want to have uh, the pro gaming experience. Beautiful. By the way, I'm having here ROG 5 with the uh, USB hub, HDMI USB hub, which has uh, three USB ports, Type-C USB port, it has LAN, uh, it has SD card expansion, and HDMI, and HDMI. Also, link for this product will be in the description. I will be leaving that, okay? Ventune, this is Ventune. You don't have to buy exactly this one, but I will leave the links in the description for these kind of USB adapters, HDMI adapters. Thank you for watching. Long video, I know, but I think you're going to be happy about this. Beautiful.